right, well, it's it's not even pre-rut yet. It's just now starting to snap off cold. Um, I'm, I'm with my buddy Hunter Blaylock. He plays baseball at Mississippi State. And he's a really tall, dumb guy, basically. He, he, he's a goofball. Action. <laughs> what are we doing today? Like I said, it, November rolls around. It's been pretty warm down here in Mississippi, and a cold front finally comes through, and he, he takes me one day in class. He said, hey, let's, let's ease over to Yazoo City Friday. We'll hunt Saturday morning, Saturday evening, come back Sunday. I said, all right, perfect. So we pull up and pull up Friday afternoon. We go in and check this camera, and sure enough, this this deer, first time checking this camera that year, and this deer's in there. And I mean, granted, he's, he's not just huge, but it, we, we definitely got excited. So we go in there that next morning, probably shouldn't have, but went in there, didn't hunt too awful long, came back out, had a big lunch, whatever, and went in there that afternoon, and we weren't there 20 minutes, and he comes feeding through there. Hunter shot him, you know, 35 yards, and he hit him way back. I don't, you'll, you might be able to slow it down in the footage and see it. He hit him way back, and we thought, sure enough, it was a gut shot. Followed a doe and came across. <laughs> um, he was like 38 yards. 35. No, he didn't stop. Uh, he came up the creek a lot faster than he did going the other way. So I waited. And once he came up, he shot up the creek because he came real slow the other way. So I waited and he came up. And then I just kind of rushed the shot and hit him behind. He took another step when I shot. So we decided to wait till the next morning after reading up on everything and doing all of our research. So you know what? This, this is too nice of a deer, too nice of a situation. We're just gonna back out and wait until the next morning. I'm Brooke with Real South Hunting, and I wanna tell you thank you for watching the show. And I wanna tell you how you can keep up with us in real time. If you'll go to our Facebook page, give us a like. If you'll go to our Instagram and give us a follow, that will let you keep up with us as things are happening. You can also go to realsouthhunting.com. You can check out some of our content on there. You can also purchase a hat there in our online store. We have over 30 different styles and colors. Each purchase helps us create the content that you're seeing now. We appreciate you watching the show and we appreciate each and every one of you that go out there and buy a hat to show support for Real South Hunting. Sure enough, we go in and there's just they, there's blood everywhere. It was a I wouldn't say a perfect shot. Some people would call it a perfect shot if you're from Texas, maybe a Texas kill shot, but Worked out good. Uh, Hunter, he was pumped up. He, I wish he could be here, but he's actually back in Yazoo working. 
right now, so he couldn't make it down to interview or do commentary or whatnot, but he's a jam up dude and he okay at hunting, not the best. I'm trying to teach him still, so.